All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. We are starting off Raw with a Raw Tag Team title match. And wait a minute. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait a minute, it's proud and powerful Santana and Ortiz here on Raw. And they are here to challenge the Colognes for the Raw Tag Team titles. The Colognes just recently won from the Revival from FTR. <laughs> Here come the champs. I got a fucking ad. Yay. Anyway. Well, you can, you can press the yeah, I know. button and I know. pause the I know. And here come the Colognes, the Raw Tag Team Champions. Who just won those titles from FTR at Extreme Rules, I believe. I, uh, could be wrong. Oh yeah, you have the, you have like the Dudley Dunn type thing. Yeah. Well, I can tell you one thing, the clothes are very experienced at you. They are very experienced, but so are Santana and Ortiz. No, they do not. And that's what I think when it comes to play. I think that Tanner Ortiz is going to come out top for that because uh, we can't tell who's the cold Cologne apart. James? I think he's the and Cologne. <laughs> <laughs> and as the great one said, Prima Cologne is the greatest of all time, which I don't think is true, but... Sorry, great one. But you, you, got, you got it all wrong. Anyway. Yeah, it's obviously Fuego now, so... Obviously it is ass, man. That, that's that's a whole different ball game right there. I'll be right back. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, there's Santana and Ortiz, proud and powerful, making their debut here on Raw. And there are. And there are there is the Raw Tag Team Champions. The Colognes. And I'm just gonna skip this because nobody fucking cares. And oh man, what a drop kick by Santana. Oh my god. Santana stomping out the arm. Of I think that's Primo Cologne. Don't quote me on that, guys. But. Uh, oh. Now, put Santana on the corner. And they get the tag. And now, wait a minute. Hurricane Rana into a power bomb. Man, what a move by the Colognes. And now, again. Another tag team move. What is this? Oh, throws him off, and a back body drop. My God. The challenger's taking on some offense. And, and Santana and Ortiz went for a tag move, but they didn't get the chance. But now Santana's in control of, I think this is... Epic of Cologne. I don't know, honestly. Oh, oh my god. Kick to the back right there. And now into the corner, but Ortiz has Primo for Epico, I think. I mean, I, I don't know. And now Santana.
trying to get the tag to Ortiz and no. And now Epico tags in Primo. The, the, the tag, the frequent tags by the Colognes is a very smart move. And look at this. Oh my God, what a move. A backbreaker cross body combo it looked like. And the Colognes have been actually in control of this match. Believe it or not. They have. And now, oh! What a spear into the corner. And now he's got him on the bottom rope. Santana's in trouble. Oh my god. What a leg drop to the neck. And now, I think this is Epico going to the top. But they still don't know which one is which. Like I said, a moonsault, but Santana counters. Oh, Santana. With a forearm. And Epico with a back suplex on Santana. Santana has not been able to get a tag into Ortiz yet. And now look at this. He's these shots on the outside of the ring. Santana and um, I think that's Primo. I still don't know. Oh my god, what's the count at? Uh, three. Get back in the ring! <laughs> Back suplex and a cartwheel by Epico. <laughs> four and a count of four here. There's a five. There's a six. Yeah, but it's gonna end the DQ. Fuck. Get in the ring, Santana. Seven. That ain't now. And since Santana's back in the ring and he goes back out. Oh my god! Thank you, Santana! Oh my god! No, don't fight! Just don't do that again! Put him in the ring! You know, up until now, it was mostly the Colognes having all the offense. by him, bro. He knows he can't win on the outside. I hope so. And now Santana on his T.O. to the corner. Man. And now, and now what's he, what's he thinking? Santana, he's the Miz. And what a neck breaker by Santana. And a cover, I think that's on Epico. I, I don't know. And Proud and Powerful have done it. Proud and... Proud and powerful are your new Raw Tag Team Champions. Well, I tell you, bro, it was a good idea to make it. Let's go. Hey, look at this. Look at this. They're, they're attacking the Colognes Chugs. What the hell is this? What the hell is this? What the hell is this? They're throwing the Colognes out of the ring. They don't want them in the ring. My God! The hell is up with Santana and Ortiz? Why the hell would they attack the Colognes after the match? Because it's bad for business. Anyway, next match. No, um, it's gonna be your favorite match. Oh no! It's ladies and gentlemen, we have Chad Gable versus Joey Janela. Your favorite match? <laughs> not my favorite match. Not be and not because it's Chad Gable. No. It's because it's Chad Gable. No. Yes. <laughs> uh, nope. Yes, you love Chad Gable. No. You know, I think you like Chad Gable. I really don't. You really do? Especially now with the short hair, he looks fucking stupid. Oh no, you love his short hair. No, I don't. I love Chad Gable. You love Otis. I fucking hate Otis. He's trash. He's overweight. He's small. He looks like he dumpster dives every week. He, bro, he looks worse than Baron Corbin. Now you know who you do like, though. You know, y'all you know, you know chat who Chugs really likes. Who? Lamar Jackson, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta pull Gable and General Steams up. I forgot. I was 
playing The Last of Us Part 2. Did he get his PlayStation 5? Four. Four? Yeah. So I'm assuming he's switching to PlayStation? Maybe not fully, but yeah. Who's, who's, who's Chad Gable? Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Chad Gable. Here comes Chad Gable. No, I fucking hate Chad Gable. This guy fucking sucks. This guy fucking sucks. I, I like I like Chad Gable better. Chad Gable? Wait a minute. I meant Shaq Gable. Shaq Gable. He, uh, that's that. Now fuck Shorty G. He's even worse than Chad Gable. No, he's not. They're different people. <laughs> you're like, you're like Dave Van Sane. Oh, and here comes Joey Janela, making his raw debut. Theme, what are you talking about? The beginning of his theme. Uh oh. Oh, this kind of vibe. Yeah. Alright, so here's Joey, Joey Janela. He's looking to... I think. I don't fucking know. But, he's looking to turn on Chad Gable. That sounds wrong, but you know what? Whatever. He's looking to get his first win here on Raw, while Chad Gable... Uh, I don't fucking know. I... We haven't done this universe in like over six months. I don't fucking remember if Chad Gable even had a match. But anyway. It's Chad Gable and Joey Janela. And here we go. Locking up at the start of the match. Now Gable has the arm. Gable has the arm of Janela. Oh. And Janela has him in the Fujiwara arm bar, aka the salt of the earth. Uh, and as it's called in some other company that we don't talk about here. But anyway. And look at this technical wrestling by Janela and Gable to start oh, off the match. Oh! Now Janela with a DDT. No, Chad Gable counters with a Northern Lights suplex. One and a kick out. And now uh, Chad Gable has the leg. Oh, he's trying to take that leg out. Of Suplex is more than he loves Lamar Jackson. But anyway. <laughs> and Joey, oh my god. What a boot by Joey oh. Janela. What a boob by Joey Janela. It's from Joey Janela. Oh my fucking god. I don't think I should be saying this on stream. And Joey with a clothesline. Well, yeah, you love your clothesline. It's your favorite move. Yeah, guess what? Suplexes. You love suplexes more than you love Lamar Jackson. <laughs> I don't like Lamar Jackson. Oh my God! Chad with a form in the corner, and Joey just popped back up and hit him with another clothesline. And now look at this: the single leg camel clutch with one knee on the well, one knee on his back, and now. Oh, wait a minute. Joey Janela. What the hell is this? A tombstone pile driver by Joey. 
Joey Janela with a tombstone pile driver on Chad Gable. And a double foot stomp. Double foot stomp by Janela. One, two, and Ch Chad Gable kicks out. Gable, I think Gable looks like he's might be busted open, I think. And now Joey with a Death Valley. No, Chad Gable counters. Chad Gable counters. Now Gable calling for Joey Janela to get up to his feet. Now Gable with these clotheslines on Joey Janela. And a jumping clothesline off the ropes there. Now Gable to the top rope as well. And now Gable turns around and a moonsault by Chad Gable. The moonsault by Gable. One, two. I want to kick out just before two by Joey Janela. Now Gable puts him in the corner. Now Chad. Look at this. Chad Gable in the corner. Oh. O'Connor roll into a German suplex. Chad Gable with that German suplex. And Janela kicks out. Joey Janela kicking out of two. And now Janela. Oh my god. What a move by Joey Janela. Now he wants Gable to his feet. He wants Chad Gable to his feet. What the hell is this? Joey Janela. Oh, what a neck breaker. A Canadian neck breaker by Janela. And Joey Janela wins. Joey Janela does it against Chad Gable. My God, Joey Janela with the win over Chad Gable. On his eight, on his on his debut here in this universe mode, and man, does Chad Gable look pissed? Chad Gable does not look happy. Now we're gonna get into the next match. Alright ladies and gentlemen, we are live here on Raw with Elias. I think he might be trying to give us, he might be wanting to give us a performance maybe. Ladies and gentlemen, I am Elias and I am here to give you the performance that Raw needs that could actually save this show. And that's the only thing I'm here for. I'm here to save this show and engrave into everyone's brains 
The WWE stands for only one thing. And what does WWE stand for? Walk with Elias. I said WWE stands for Walk with Elias. That's right. That's right. You you guys get it. WWE will always and forever stand for Walk with Elias. And now we're about to get into this performance. So people in the back turn on the music turn off these lights too so that I can be the center of attention so that these people can hear the greatest music in Raw's history and wait a minute that music sounds familiar That music sounds familiar. Here comes Darby Allen. All right, Darby Allen. Elias, no one wants to hear your sh crappy music no one wants to hear it I mean I'd rather hear you know what I'd rather watch 10 hours of Mickey Mouse than hear your music and I'm sure any of these fans would rather watch the worst WWE match than listen to your music listen Darby if you wanted to do wet with Elias all you had to do was ask serious all you had to do was ask if you wanted a duet with Elias, the best musical performer in this current generation. No, Elias, I didn't come for a duet. I didn't come for a duet. I came to stop your music. I came, I came to uh, shut that music down. I came to make sure you didn't perform another song, another god-awful song. And I came to make sure that you didn't say another word. Oh, really, Darby? That's it, huh? You just wanted to stop these people from hearing the best music in wrestling history. The best music in WWE history. The best music in Raw's history. Hell, the best music in pro wrestling's history. That's all. That's it. Yeah, that is it. Because you see, your music is like drinking bleach. Okay. Your music sucks. Nobody wants to hear it. As long as I'm around, nobody will hear it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down, man. Alright? I mean... You can't always get what you want. Alright? As long as I'm still around, there will be music. Okay? I will still be giving out performances. Even if I have to be giving performances in my own private locker room. Alright, well, another thing. Oh! Darby just socked Elias right in the face. Darby Allen just hit Elias right in the face. Oh, and Darby leaping in the corner. And now Elias with a DDT on Darby Allen. And a kick to the back. That mare. Oh, and Darby trying to fight back here. Darby's trying to fight back, and Elias counters. Darby counters. And 
now. Elias. Oh my god, Elias. With a clothesline on Darby Allen that probably almost took his head off. Went for a chop block. And Elias with a Luthes press on Darby Allen. And Elias now. With a stomp on Darby Allen. Now Darby is looking at. Oh, look at this. Elias head first. Goes Darby Allen and into the barricade. Darby Allen is down. And now Darby Allen's got to get checked on here. We got to go into the next match, though. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here comes Kevin Owens. And there's Kevin Owens, ladies and gentlemen. Kevin Owens, of course, going one on one with Mustafa Ali of Retribution. And of course, Kevin's had multiple problems with Mustafa over the past maybe month. Retribution along with their leader Mustafa Ali. Slapjack Mason T-Bar.
No, we'll stop all we're looking to we're looking to beat Kevin Owens here tonight. Kevin, same thing. He's looking to Kevin's looking to shut Mustafa Ali down. Mustafa looking to do that exact same thing to Kevin Owens. gentlemen here we go Owens Ali and oh and Ali just took out the referee Ali wants to go clothesline Owens and he took the referee out and look at this at Owens now with a hammerlock Russian leg sweep on Ali Now, oh. Now Owens. And Ali now fighting back. And now Ali and Owens going back and forth in the corner. And now, right now it's all Ali right now. And Ali with a drop kick in the corner. Quite a unique drop kick as well. And Ali. Oh, and Kevin Owens. Oh, the dragon screw on Mustafa Ali. Twisting out the leg. And Ali. Oh, what a drop kick. Owens threw him up like a, like a pop up. And Ali just drop kicked him. Now Ali, oh what a DDT by Mustafa Ali. And now Mustafa throws him in the corner, and what a forearm to the face. And now one, oh not even a wood count, Kevin Owens kicks out. And now, oh what a shining wizard. Ali goes to the top. Top rope. Went for an elbow, but Kevin moves. Kevin going for the cover. Ali kicking out at one. Not even really close to one. Now Owens. Throws him out of the ring. Now. Owen picks him up. Ali now. Fighting back. Kevin Owens and Ali. Oh my god, and Kevin just knocked Ali to the floor. Owens just right handed Ali right in the face. Now Kevin and Ali. And Ali throws him back in. And Owens. Fighting back once again. Oh my god. Now Ali throws him to the apron. Once again. Kevin Owens takes it back in. Throws him to the corner. Ali. And look at this. Full Nelson reverse DDT. Oh my goodness. Now Ali, what the hell is he planning to do here? He's got Kevin Owens across the ring. He's... Owen, look at... Oh, wait a minute! 
Ali just hit the referee with that neck breaker from the apron. And I think Owens might have moved out of the way and threw the referee in front of Ali. I have no idea, but anyway, Ali. Owen that reverse 450, but Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens gets the knees up, and now Owens. Oh, Northern Lights. Northern Lights suplex, and now Kevin. And Ali with a kick to the gut. Kevin Owens counters. And now Kevin. And look at this snap suplex to Ali. Now oh, Kevin. Oh, and just smashes all he smashes all his head into the corner. And Ali trying to fight back again. And now Owens. I've seen this before. This pump handle neck breaker to Ali. My God, the back of his neck across his knee. And now Ali. Oh. Oh, and Kevin with a kick. Now Lee. Oh, a reverse Hurricane Rana on Kevin Owens. And he wants Kevin up. Oh, look at this, Ali. Oh. And look at this. Come back here by Ali. And his kick. And Ali throws Owens and Owens went for something, but Ali counters it with an arm drag. And now Owens has Ali. And a pop up power bomb on Ali. Two and now Ali kicks out. Ali just kicked out of the pop-up power bomb at two. Oh, Kevin with a with a headlock. KO. Now Kevin Owens again with his hammer lock. Russian leg sweep. And Ali with a neck breaker. And now Owens again. Another pop up power bomb. That one's got to be it. Two, three, and Kevin Owens does it. Kevin Owens picks up the win against Ali. this first pop-up powerbomb that Ali kicked out of. I thought it was done right there. Kevin Owens pins Mustafa Ali here tonight on Raw.
Now we are gonna get on with the next match. For the Inner Continental Championship. Gentlemen, here we are for the Intercontinental title. The challenger Ricochet, the champion Andrade. Ricochet could become Intercontinental Champion tonight. Gentlemen, here is Andrade. The Intercontinental Champion Andrade with Zelina Vega, of course. His business manager, as he calls her.
here. Caught El Champion Andrade, of course. Getting a victory over Elias at Extreme Rules, I believe. Don't quote me on that. But. Andrade is looking to defend his Intercontinental title tonight against Ricochet. Will Andrade still remain Intercontinental Champion after tonight? Or will Ricochet become the new Intercontinental Champion? Championship on the line. The There's Ricochet and Andrade. Of course, with Zelina Vega at ringside, and here we go. And look at this Andrade driving Ricochet into the corner. Oh, you know, a, a clean break right there by Ricochet and Andrade. A little surprised. I would have thought Andrade would have. Made a cheap shot, and now they're on the ropes here. And a clean break once again. And Ricochet with a backdrop suplex on Andrade. And a kick to the chest. And now Ricochet has Andrade. Oh, man. Oh. What a gut wrench powerbomb. A deadlift one at that. Oh my god, Andrade going after the arm. And Ricochet now went for a DDT. And Andrade now counters in a hurricane run by Andrade. Wow. Now Andrade. Look at this. Oh my god, what a punch to the face. And a Northern Light suplex. And Ricochet, Ricochet kicks out. Ricochet with an uppercut. And Ricochet. Andrade clotheslines Ricochet over the top rope and out of the ring. My god. Andrade is in control right now. Oh, Ricochet coming back. Throws Andrade back inside the ring. Kicks Andrade. Andrade counters. Ricochet counters that boot. Andrade. And now he's got him in this. And look at this stun gun over the top rope. From the Oklahoma slam position, of course. Now Ricochet. Hurricane Rana on Andrade. First Andrade did Hurricane Rana. Now Ricochet returned to the favor. And Ricochet with a big boot. My God, Ricochet with a boot. Now Andrade has his feet on Ricochet's chest. Oh God. Now Andrade. And look at Andrade just flipping Ricochet across the ring. And Andrade. Oh my God. God, he just slapped Ricochet right in the face. Ricochet just got slapped in the face. And a drop kick to the back now. Oh my God, Andrade with a right hand. Ricochet now. And Ricochet clotheslines Andrade over the top and out of the ring. And a Ricochet. Oh! Um, well, I guess Zelina Vega just took the bullet for a chop by Ricochet, which he meant for Andrade, but I guess she took the bullet. Anyway, Andrade is still the Intercontinental Champion. 
Oh my god. Buckle up because we have a contest that's going to blow the roof off this place. We have a team led by a real fan favorite versus the New Day. Time to rock and roll. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. There's Scorpio Sky and Ethan Page, aka okay? Men of the Year, as they call themselves. Making their debut here on Raw. Vicky and Woods are in action tonight against Sky and Page. And Kofi Kingston is here as well, of course, but he is not in this match. He's got a match right after this, as a matter of fact. Which Vicky and Woods will not be ringside for. Page and Xavier Woods starting this match out. And here we go, Woods and Page starting this match out. And now look at this. Oh, clean break. Now Page. And 
now. Big E is in. Big E and Xavier Woods with a flapjack on Ethan Page. And now Big E is legal. And now Big E is in control of Ethan Page. Oh my god. And Woods gets the tag. I think New Day are looking to make frequent tags in this match, which is pretty smart. The New Day are experienced as a tag team in Woods with a Fisherman's Neckbreaker. Now Ethan Page. Oh. Owen Woods with a knee to the face of Ethan Page. And he's looking to tag it to Scorpio Sky and he does. Sky is in the match and Woods just stopped his momentum right there. Oh, but Sky with a clothesline. And now Woods with a neck breaker. Oh my god. What a neck breaker by Xavier Woods. And Big E is in. Oh, and oh man, one and a kick out by Scorpio Sky and Big E. Scorpio Sky with a clothesline of Big E's net back of Big E's head. Now Sky, wait a minute. Look at the submission by Scorpio Sky. I think Big E got his foot on the ropes. Now Sky, and Big E counters, oh! Sky counters with a jawbreaker. Oh, it's Scorpio Sky. Now Big E, Tiger suplex across the ring. Man. And Sky now. Takes down Big E. Now Scorpio Sky has Big E in the on the ropes, right where Ethan Page is, and Scorpio Sky throws him or gets thrown over the top rope. Now Sky is back in, throws him into the corner, tags in Ethan Page. What what are what are they doing here? Oh, and a double clothesline to Big E. Man, a little surprised that even took him down. But now Big E, and oh, wait a minute, I know what this is. The Unicorn Stampede by Big E and Xavier Woods. Look at this. Stomp it away on Ethan Page is the new day. And now, oh, and a drop kick by Woods. My God. Oh, I think Scorpio Sky just broke up the pin. Now Sky is down. Now Woods and E don't have to worry about Scorpio Sky for for a little bit. Now they can worry about taking Page, Ethan Page down, but Ethan Page has already taken down Xavier Woods here. And look at this crank to the neck here. Oh, man. And I look at Paige. Oh my God. What a slam by Ethan Page. And Xavier Woods kicks out. And now Woods throws Ethan Page into the corner. Oh. Page with a cutter. What a cutter by Ethan Page. And now Page with a forearm into the corner. And now Ethan Page has Xavier Woods ready. And wait a minute. He's got Woods. 
Oh my god, the Eagles Edge by Ethan Page. Ethan Page with the Eagles Edge on Woods. One, and Big E breaks it up. Oh, and Big E takes down Page. Both men are down, and Big E takes out Sky again. Scorpio Sky gets back to his feet. And now Sky with a snap mirror to the ring to Big E. It takes Big E out. And now Big E is down. And now Woods, DDT to Ethan Page. And now Xavier Woods, he's calling for it. And the honor roll, now Ethan Page counters it. Ethan Page just countered the honor roll. And now Woods is back in control. Tornado DDT. And Woods to the top rope. And, here come Xavier Woods. and a elbow drop from Xavier Woods. The elbow drop from Xavier Woods. Will he be victorious? And he got a near fall out of it. So resourceful. Xavier Woods is one of the most energetic superstars in WWE today. In June of 2016, Xavier's ability to the New Day become the longest reigning WWE Tag Team Champions of all time. Oh, oh, it certainly is a new day. Yes, it is. Oh, boy, he is rolling. And now. All right, we're good now. Sorry, I thought my mic stopped Xavier working, but. Too quick that time. Xavier, Xavier Woods now. Beneath the page. Now Ethan Page on the top rope. What is what the hell is this? Ethan Page has him. Oh my god, what a power slam from the top rope. And Biggie again breaks it up. And Ethan Page is getting ready for the ego's edge. And Woods counters. Backbreaker by Woods. Now Woods throws him. Now wait a minute, Woods has him in the big ending of Big E. Oh my god, the midnight hour. The midnight hour on Ethan Page and Scorpio Sky breaks it up. Oh, and Woods with a neck breaker on Scorpio Sky. Now Big E. Oh my god, what a power bomb! To Ethan Page. Hitting him one, two, Page kicks out. And now Ethan Page taking Big E towards his corner, but Big E, Big e counters. Big E. And Ethan Page now. Throws him into his corner. Wait, no, no, he's not. Oh my god, what a side slam by Ethan Page. A leg drop. And a knee drop. And now Ethan Page. Look at this. This unique style of the camel clutch. By Ethan Page. No, it's not over yet. Big E gets out. He wants to do this and now E with a hip toss back inside the ring. And now Big E. Right, look at this splash by Big E. The height he gets on that splash. Oh, and he kicked out. Scorpio Sky was going to break it up. But he was just too far away. Yeah, 
to break with the pinfall. Uh oh, it, he was going for a power bomb, but Ethan Page countered. Now Biggie. Ethan Page and Big E going back and forth right now. Ethan Page. And look at the spine buster on Big E by Ethan Page. And Woods breaks up the pinfall with a, with a sliding knee there on the. And now Ethan Page. What the? Oh my god. He's got Big E up. Oh my god. Oh! Yes, uh, Ricochet slapped Zelina Vega and got himself disqualified. <laughs> One, two, and Big E kicks out. And no, I'm not joking. Why, Ricochet, are you feminist? Slap Zelina Vega's titties or fucking something. Bro, he has a girlfriend. <laughs> and Ethan Page. gonna be mad? Oh my god. And Big E takes out Ethan Page. Or does he? I don't know. Anyway. I'm watching this right and now. Big E taking the straps off. He's showing us his titties. <laughs> Speaking of titties, how, how big do you think his titties are? I don't know. I don't know, Chucks. I'm asking you. You're a titty expert. Well, You're John Moxley. Yeah, I'm the titty master. God damn, man. This titty master. <laughs> so what's the point of taking off the what's your point of showing the kids you just on the neck ring? Tomcat's favorite move! Yeah, you know Ethan, Ethan Page. Page it's bleeding night wrong. Oh my god. And he tags a Scorpio Sky for like the first time in the match in like forever. I want a drop kick by Scorpio Sky. It's over. Drop kick. Yeah. Wait, what, what happened to Woods? Um, I don't know. Scorpio looking to fly. Oh, he's not good. Scorpio looking to fly. Oh my god, a tope con hello. I'm Biggie. I don't know. Oh, there he is. And now Scorpio. Oh my god, a DDT on the floor. I think he is too. But with, but with this game's lighting, you can't tell just because he's black. Now Scorpio Sky. What are you doing? Oh my god, a spear through the barricade to Big E. He just speared E through the barricade. He's only the third match. So he's fourth. Yeah. So we got three more matches. And now, oh my god. Alright. Alright, I thought. Yeah, he got interrupted again. Yeah, and Xavier Woods gets the tag. And oh, Woods with the clothesline. Forearm by Woods. Oh. And now. Oh, no. Oh, my God, Woods. And he fucking missed. How? 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 My one redemption, Woods. Now, oh, and Sky just punches Woods right in the face. What with the count tab? Three. Three, I think. To win this thing. I wanna... Here, why don't I do this? Why don't I do this? I'm gonna go to. What was it? This. Where is it? This. I'm gonna turn this on. There. What? I just turned display count referee counts on. I'm not gonna do that. Why? Because it's just. He wants to I'm the good. Outside. I've never seen it though. It, it just makes the camera look weird. And now Woods flexing on us. He says, "I fuck Paige, you not you, Scorpio." I was just gonna say, "What the fuck, Biggie? Is Biggie Raquel doing on Gonzalez the apron?" Nice. I was just. No, nice. I was just gonna say, what the fuck is Biggie doing on the apron? 
He's <laughs> a match pancake, are you dumb? <laughs> oh, what do you mean? He's not in the match. And Scorpio tags in Paige. Now Paige went for a kick. Botchamania. The way he, he, he missed it. And now Woods. And look at this. Oh! Oh! What a kick. Bro, Dexter's lucky, bro. Yeah, he's got the girl, man. And now E, Biggie, Stole my girl. slapping his titties. Stole he's Dexter. looking for it. He's got Ethan Page. Oh, oh yeah, he's big in oh, Big in this match. Yeah, this might be the end of the match here. Bruh, Woods just ran away from Scorpio Sky. <laughs> Fucking dumbass. No, Big E. No, he broke the pin. I think he was going for a scoop slam. Now Ethan Page thinks he's smart, but he's actually fucking stupid. <laughs> actually, Scorpio Sky is even dumber than he is, so I can't say anything. Bro, Xavier Woods is a fucking duck. He ran away dead, bro. <laughs> oh yeah. What the fuck? That's, that's smart. What do you mean that's smart? Yeah, no, that, that's that's really yeah, smart. God damn it. What are these? What is this? Flowers, Come on, come on. Okay, Ethan, get in the ring. He walked in Johnny's And now, Big E, oh my god, what a shoulder tackle. And Big E clapping, clapping his cheeks. No, that was fine. Big E now, looking for the big ending that he was going for, but Ethan Page counters. And now, Ethan Page. Putting Big E on the top rope. And now setting him up for something on the top rope. When we saw this earlier on Woods. And now Ethan Page going to do it to Big E. Oh my god, what a power slam from the top rope. Ego's edge. It's not Ego's edge. Oh, and Woods breaks it up and Scorpio Sky's down as well. Yeah. Now Ethan Page, what the fuck is he about to do? Oh, nothing apparently. Oh wait, he's got E. Oh, and Big E counters. Never mind. Now Big E, he's going for that big ending on Ethan Page. Yeah, he did. And Scorpio's down. Oh, Scorpio is down. Now, ref, count it. One, two, and the New Day beats Ethan Page and Scorpio Sky. Damn. The New Day are going to become a... I don't know how many times. I think, it, I, I think they're 11 right now. They might be the GOAT. They're underrated in my opinion. Maybe. Dun dun. A bunch of dun, underrated rats are on team. Dun dun dun. Oh, he's dun. shaking his ass. <laughs> Kofi shaking that ass. He goes to the Oh my god. I thought he was going to be getting out of the five. That break up is Kofi. God damn it. God damn it. Well, Scorpio's guy needs to pay his debut. Didn't go as planned. Nope. Knew they didn't follow the script. <coughs> oh, yeah. Your favorite match. Baron Corbin versus Kofi's gonna come out and shake his ass again. <laughs> <laughs> Starting to 
switches up for this match. No, I know what I'm gonna do. Skip, skip Kofi's. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. But you know what I'm gonna do? Watch. Skip Baron Corbin. No, watch. <gasps> no, not put the homeless. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna do homeless Corbin, aren't you? Watch this shit. Watch this shit, Chugs. I'm watching. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Here comes Baron Corbin. He can't afford. He can't afford the rest of his team. Yeah. No. I'm not gonna do that. I'm getting a Monday Night Raw ad on your screen for some reason. Champion, NFL offensive lineman. We don't even have ad revenue. How am I getting an ad? I don't know. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, Corbin versus Kingston. And here we go. And Corbin now. Oh. Damn. Watching the uh, raw on my computer. Okay. Now, oh! Now Kingston with a snap suplex, but Corbin reverses it because Corbin is just like Pancake. Wow. He doesn't sell suplexes. Right? Yeah. Since they like attacked him. So he fucking burnt a Latino man. What? Oh my god! The Dragonoff guy! Yeah, Ilja. He's held it for like two years, man. And the NXT UK champion. 856 days. Yeah. Actually, well, it's more like a thousand days somewhere, really, but it's. I guess they're not counting the days that NXT UK just didn't air when during COVID, which I wouldn't either. So. And now, Kingston. Kingston 
Calling Corbin up. Trouble in paradise. There it is, the trouble in paradise on on Corbin. Cover. Come on, swim. One, two, and Corbin kicks out. It's been two years, four months, and five days since Walter won the NXT UK title. Fuck. Two years? Dude, that's dumb. Yeah. Really dumb. Uh, oh. Oh. What does Baron Corbin need to do now? I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. He's really starting to look fatigued here, guys. And when that happens, your whole body starts to give out on you. He's going to need to be careful here. He's taking on some damage, but so is his opponent. This match can go either way at this point. And now, Corbin has Kofi. Oh, my God. Oh. Uh, Joe. Oh yeah. Carrying Cross is getting bored now. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit. He's going for the pin. Whoa! What? Oh shit. And now Corbin throws Kingston into the exposed turnbuckle. Oh my god. And now Corbin reverses that neck breaker. And now Corbin. Oh, and he plants Kofi Kingston. Look at this. The neck crank chugs his favorite move. Now Corbin with the right hand. Kingston counters. Kofi now. And look at this monkey flip on Corbin. Are you that Corbin did a monkey flip? <laughs> Imagine Corbin doing a monkey flip. Now Kofi, oh, and Corbin counters. And now Corbin, end of days to Kofi Kingston. One, two, and Baron Corbin wins. He gets money. Yay. Money. Baron Corbin beats Kofi Kingston here tonight. Yeah, big win for that young man. And... Wait a minute. What's he thinking now? And what the hell? Oh, come on, Corbin. He's stomping oh, dude, a. Bro, you have money. He's stomping a mud hole in Kingston. He just take his money. Yeah, he's gonna get. He's gonna take his five dollars in shots. He's gonna come out and shoot him in the balls. Anyway, we're getting on to the next match, because fuck court. I don't even know who the fuck's coming out second, third, or fourth. What the f Oh, wait. No, I do now. Never mind. Forget what I said. Oh, my God. Dragon off said he's going to do the impossible. He's going to make the impossible possible. He beat Walter, and he said, I can do what you couldn't do, Pete. Oh, my God. About to get his ass whooped by Pete Darnani. Mm. <laughs> Out of main event. Yeah. Pete Dunn said Dragon Off won't make the takeover out of tonight. Will we see Pete Dunn versus Walter versus Dragon Off? Dude. Oh, god damn. LA Knight and Cameron Grimes are on the screen. Oh my god. And oh my god, Cameron Grimes is drinking LA Knight's drink. What? <laughs> yes.
Chase to win this match. Mm, I don't know. Imagine Rush that, bro. Imagine <laughs> Miro retains. Imagine Kenny gets the one way Chase and then Rusev throws him out of the ring. <laughs> <laughs> You need to download another Adam page or the one that Omega Man has. Yeah, I know. Yeah! <laughs> you know, you said, yeah! And now, ladies and gentlemen, here comes the former WWE Champion. This isn't BZW. Fuck you. At least put the sword in it. <laughs> the crowd moves their shit right now for Drew McIntyre. And here hey, is man. the former WWE champion who lost the title to King Rusev at Extreme Rules. Alright, you lost the title to Miro that at Extreme kinda. Rules. <laughs> yeah, it does kind of. Well, one thing, this could be Drew McIntyre's time. McIntyre might be the strongest man in this match. We say Nero, but he's not our strong. He's kind of got a little weight for us. Drew McIntyre is built for muscle. Yeah. When he first debuted in wrestling, he was skinny. Now look yeah, he was a skinny little... He was a skinny little bitch, but now look at him. He's a big... big he's a big sweaty man that Vince McMahon would really like. We all know that much. Omega. Kenny Omega is here on Raw. And I think the crowd is absolutely losing it right now. Here on Monday Night Raw. I don't... I don't think we've ever expected Kenny Omega to be here on Monday Night Raw. Yeah, for sure. I have no idea, but I think we're about to find out. Hey, wait a minute! It's Adam Page! What's he doing on Raw? I think they are gonna lose their voice tonight. I bet he has. My God. I'm going to play Miro's new theme. Oh, <laughs> and here comes Miro, the WWE champion. Don't ignore that other name that it says on the on the nameplate thing. Ignore that name. That is not his name. Ignore that name on his shirt too. They gave him the wrong attire. They gave him the wrong name. 
You know what? He kind of looks good with the WWE title, though. Can't lie. Oh, it looks pretty good. It does, though. That makes him look more fucking beast than he already is. Yeah, for real. <laughs> They also put the wrong name on his side plates, but we don't talk about that. He looks scary as hell. Oh, now he's having a seizure. <laughs> Actually, the, the, his new theme ain't that bad, though. What the fuck? People are hating on him. They are. Andre Chase. Bruh. There's Drew McIntyre, Kenny Omega, Hangman out of Page, and Miro. Look at McIntyre going right after Page. And Omega with a knee to Miro. <laughs> and Hangman. And look at Miro. Oh my god. God, he just ran over Omega. Adam Page was going for a DDT or, of some sort, maybe. But McIntyre counters. Oh my goodness. And now McIntyre throws Omega over the top rope. Bruh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Now McIntyre and Omega fighting on the outside of the ring. The former WWE Champion versus the WWE Champion. <laughs> According to JR. Holy! And now McIntyre went for an elbow. And Omega with a leg drop to the arm of McIntyre. This match is going to take forever. We don't talk about it though. No, it's not. Are you high? No. No. What? No, the last match was the main event. And McIntyre rolls up Omega. Small package. Two. Oh, and he almost became the new WWE champion right there. Imagine he would have won like that. And Hangman just booted him right in the back. And McIntyre throws Hangman Adam Page out of the ring. Now Mac thinks he's Eddie Kingston. Oh my. John Moxley, but whatever. And now McIntyre. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Now McIntyre throws Omega back in the ring. Hangman going after McIntyre here. McIntyre thinks he's Jeff Morgan. Oh. Hangman throws McIntyre out of the ring. What the hell is Hangman grabbing? And Hangman has. This is a no disqualification match for the WWE title. I am the table. Imagine Miro winning this match. I want a shot to the, to the, the gut. Me too, man. Yeah. And now Miro. Oh my god, just throw him over. Wait, Ted DiBiase said it? Oh my god. And McIntyre with that headbutt to Miro. And Hangman and Omega. Oh my god. And Hangman has um, a pop-up power bomb on the outside of the ring. Oh, 
and McIntyre with the Claymore on the outside. And Omega with a V trigger. McIntyre playing Yeet the Miro. got Adam Page here. Oh my god, what a fall away slam by. And, what a reversal from Drew and now, in the, the devil's playground right now. Oh my god, what a neck breaker by Page. And McIntyre just powerbombed Omega. And, um, I don't know. What? Andy Rose. Uh uh. And now Miro. Oh my god, an Alab oh my god, an Alabama slam to Hangman Page on the ladder. Oh, and Adam Page calling for the end. Buckshot Lariat. Wait a minute, Adam Page. And hey, oh, and Miro kicked out. Miro kicked out. And Hangman punches in the face of McIntyre. And now look at Hangman. Oh, man. Yeah, at least, he, at least someone can hit that comeback. And Hangman. Oh, what a right hand. And a shooting star press. And Hangman and Omega. V trigger. And Hangman's down. One, two, and Hangman kicks out. You fucking dumbass. And Omega tire. Oh, the air raid siren, but Omega, Omega. One way danger! Oh, he was going for the future shock on Miro. Miro's now doing a busting. <laughs> oh, and Hangman kicked out. Um, and now Omega. Boom! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you're witnessing Chugs losing his shit. Oh no, McIntyre's gonna play Yeet the Miro. <laughs> Yeet the Kenny. And now McIntyre looking at Omega. And he's going for the future shock. Boom, and there it is. Future shock on Omega. And Miro breaks it up. And the ref got in the way of Hangman breaking it up. This ref sucks. This ref sucks. Get him fired. Get him fired. Get him fired. And now, bro, Miro just died. And now Miro, oh, he just got power bombed by McIntyre. Dude, I don't even know who's gonna win at this point. Speed dealer. Like, every, 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 and hang me on the German suplex on Drew McIntyre. And Kenny! V-Trigger! 
the trigger. A oh, hangman. Oh my god, another Boston Crab. Another Boston Crab. Omega, don't tap out, please. Okay, good. <laughs> now, Kenny, he's got Miro. Oh, wait a minute. One winged angel. Who's gonna hit all my <laughs> dumbass Kenny? Now McIntyre. Who the hell is this girl? Oh, the headbutt. Oh, he's gonna oh, pin him off that. of it. Oh, and Kenny kicked out. I thought Drew was gonna be a two-time champ right there. I just now realized Gigi Doland, <laughs> aka Priscilla Kelly, loved in the back, is on. And now Hangman, what the hell is this? Wait. Oh. Um. I believe so. And Miro with the Machka kick. And McIntyre. Oh. Kenny. Kenny. Yes. And Kenny gets thrown out. And Miro, he's got Hangman Adam Page in it. Game, Game over. over. Hangman tapped out right away. Oh my god. No, no, Hangman tapped out before he even let go of it, and then they broke it up. And ladies and gentlemen, Here is your winner. the GM of Raw try to put Miro against three of the toughest people in the oh world, and Miro outlasted all of them. Why? Pete Dunne versus Oh. I mean. I can find some way to. Watch dope content. Okay. On Twitch. Oh, okay. Oh my God, Priscilla Kelly, stop elbowing her. Oh yeah, that, that, that. Yeah. We're retained. We we've said imagine Miro retains before it even started. And he retains. Hmm 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 hmm. Yeah, he's great. Anyway. Hey, Anyways, that's going to do it for Raw this week. Um, oh, you, did you already book SmackDown? No, I haven't. I'm going to do that right now. Oh, the fiend. <laughs> Wait, show me the match card before you do it. I haven't I haven't um put put it in yet. No, I mean, show me like the match card that it has by default. Fiend and Randy AJ. Seth. Okay. Fiend and AJ. Triple H and Buddy Murphy versus the Usos. What? Nia with Jax with a call out <laughs> promo. Alistair Black versus Sid Cara. Ronda versus Sonya Deville. Billy K versus Carmella. And that's that's it. I'm not keep, keep it. I'm not keeping that. You're keeping it. I'm not keeping it. Hey, who's my uni it. who's my universal champion? You're keeping it. Thank you, you're keeping it.